So now, after the four ten for three. We're doing what's called heart shock, which for me is more like fucking heart attack. <laughs> um, so one ten sandbag, uh, twenty meter course, jog twenty, sprint twenty, by sprint probably like I'm not sprinting as fast as I can because I'll rip my hamstring off. Uh, but you know, just picking up the pace, um, and then twenty meter with the one ten bag. Uh, that's one rep, I've got to do three reps. 180 meters, jogging, sprinting, and carrying a 110 kilogram sandbag. Uh, and I've got three sets of that with uh, six minutes rest in between. So I've been doing this for, I think it's coming up five weeks now. Maybe five or six weeks, as, as long as I've been with Shane. Um, you know, it, it, it's, it's not difficult to be fair, like, I think it's quite easy to get lazy with stuff like this. Like, there's no reason why you can't be training this kind of year round, um, which is ironic me saying that because I wasn't training it year round before, but you know, uh, just try not to be lazy. And then if a comp comes around, you know, I've, obviously I can get stronger still doing this sort of like fitness stuff. So if I can do both, just improve overall as an athlete, like it's all good being a big deadlifter, but I need to be a big deadlifter, a good blog presser, a, good move a good fitness like you know they say that top three in every event wins world's strongest one so I need to do that and if I want to win it six times I need to be fucking doing that a bit more don't I? that's the first time I've done a sandbag that has that tie in the top so the reason I fucked it up the second pick especially is because I didn't grab the knot I tried to grab here yeah, but then there's no sand that. there yeah. so you can't grab it but just make it better. Started week one with a 100 kilo sack. Uh, so week one, I think it was two sets of three with, you know, rest was just whatever it took me to come round. So it was probably about fucking 20 minutes now. It was only like 10. Um, so <laughs> there was just two sets of that. The next week after it was three sets of three. So three runs through of it with uh, eight minutes rest. And then the next week it was six minutes rest. And then as my static lifts have been going up, we've been doing like one or two sets of this, but uh, increasing the amount of runs I'm doing. So last week was the last run that I did on the 100 kilo sandbag, and I did five reps, but one set. So that'd be 300 meters total uh, with jogging, sprinting, and carrying a 100 kilo sandbag, which I mean, if I set off to run around a fucking 300 meter running track, I'd probably die. So, trying to do, a, <laughs> trying to do a 160 body weight with a sandbag as well, it's a bit tougher. But yeah, just being honest, trying to work really hard at what I'm not so good at, you know, because that's what's going to make me better. So, absolutely smashing it. Ready, set, go.
moment. right down. Well, hot surprise to be fair. Yeah, so Deborah's done, heart shock done. Uh, the first week I did heart shock, I only did two sets of three with unlimited rest. Um, and to be honest, if I'd left that, it was a lot heavier bag-wise. You know, there was only six minutes rest between each set. Um, so, so, if I left that for the second set, I'd have been all right. Uh, when you're already in that, like, VO2 depth, and then you're in over fucking 180 meters with a jog spin and 110 kilo sack. Not that I could say that I was jogging or spinning or carrying a sack at the end of it. I think I was just trying to fucking collapse, you um, know. You know, again, like you're only as strong as your weakest link, then for the minute, like, that's what would have been my weakest link, so, you know, deadlifts are easy. That's not easy, but that's what's going to win me all strongest man, not deadlifts, so, you know, got to get it done. But just finishing off now, so, four sets of 15 lap pull downs, six lap pump, uh, and then some planks, just a bit of core, and then go home and eat some food and get to bed. So that's this Tuesday night done. Um, went really well. PB deadlift set, 4 10 for 3. Uh, heart shock, which was a fucking shock. Uh, lap pull downs and then some, uh, some planks. So, all in all, good session. Gonna get off 10 o'clock, go home, eat, go to bed. Uh, so, yeah, good day's work. It's what I need to be doing now to put in the groundwork when the season kind of starts again, when that starts again. I need to be ready and we don't know when it's going to start again so it's better to prepare for nothing than to be not prepared for something I suppose so yeah training hard grafting away nothing changes keep subscribing to official strongman you know you've got to be a student of the game that's all I am you're never too good to learn uh, you know I, I steal I steal stuff off people all the time so especially on official strongman you know it's the best place tutorials training videos if you want to copy the best guys in the world then just buy a membership it's easy as so yeah subscribe to official strongman Follow me if you want to follow me and I'll see you next one.